Hello everybody and this is Ty back with another video for you and what you're looking at is my Neo Geo board right here. This is a four slot. I've got this is the bottom board and uh, what I'm doing today is I've actually removed this is the original um, nickel cadmium battery that was in this. Okay right there 3.6 volts 50 milli milliamp hours and nickel cadmium. Okay this is completely dead it doesn't charge anymore so that's uh that's garbage, but what they can do is actually can damage your Neo Geo when, when they leak. So um, I removed this to prevent it from actually do, doing any damage. I'm going to move in nice and close here. You can see my baby there, little boy. Um, there wasn't any uh, acid damage on this board at all. Right there. Okay, you can see it looks pretty darn good. That's just some flux from the soldering. Okay, and then you see right here, that resistor, this resistor has been removed. Um, where did I set it? It's down right here somewhere. And I don't see it. <laughs> it's right. It's right here somewhere on the workbench. But anyways, it was, there was a 470 um, ohm resistor right there, and I've removed that from the board, and that connects over to the positive end of this battery from the, this um, transistor right here. And that um, this is the this is the charging circuit, and we don't want to charge the battery that I'm going to put in here because what I have here is a um, this is a 3.6. I mean, this is a three volt lithium battery right here. Okay, and then you're like, where am I going to put this battery, right? Well, what I did is, in order to even get to this, I had to actually take this whole thing apart. So what I've done is I've mounted the battery holder on the bottom of the Neo Geo right here. And I had to cut away some of this um, protective um, stuff right here. And it really, I don't even need to glue it back down. It doesn't really do anything, but I'll just, matter of fact, I'll just do that right now. A little hot glue right there. There's not going anywhere. Oh, <laughs> I guess it is. Hold there for a second. Okay, so now, so I've got the battery holder right there, and you'll see here that the positive end is going to the positive lead. I just slide this in right here, and now this thing is all set. It will save games and uh, all my settings. Really, I didn't. I mean, not, not that it saves games, but saves your game settings. But the really thing that drove me bonkers is um, I want it to be in free select for the uh, game selection and uh, without having to credit it because I have it set in free play. And so that was really annoying when I was trying to do that. So uh, um, it's good to have this back. So I'm going to reassemble this and then um, I'll just show you when it's all back together again and then I'll show you it running. Okay, you can see my Neo Geo is back together. Well, at least the board is. Just a little quick look here. And if you look on the bottom, you'll see there's the battery holder. Okay, so now to put it back into the uh, cabinet. Okay, so now I've got the uh, Neo Geo back together. And if I open it up in here, oops, <laughs> um, you'll see that it's all back together. The only thing is, you notice that there's no cart cartridge in the first slot. And that's because that first slot, the graphics are glitched with whatever cart, whatever cart I put in it. And I've tried cleaning it. There's something just probably wrong with the board. And I even looked at that. I checked all the traces and touched up some uh, pins, but I still didn't get it working. I'll probably send it to someone who's really good with Neo Geos and see if they can get it to, get it to work. Or maybe I'll just swap out with a different Neo Geo board at some point. But yeah, so it's back together. And you see now it says it's level one. All right, so if I turn this thing off, Side. Okay, so now it's off. I'm just going to wait a few seconds. Okay, turn it back on. See, it says level one. And if I press the game select button right here, I can change through the games. So it's all saving everything now, which is great. I'll have some more videos about my Neo Geo because there's a bunch of other things that I'm going to be doing to it in the future. Um, I got this for $125, which is a great price for this machine. Um, but there's some things that need to be done. Um, so let's just start off with the first few things. Is someone tried to pry it open right here. So there's some cabinet damage right there. You can see it right there. I'm going to touch that up. Um, I've already redone the control panel on it. Um, I mean, it's the original control panel. I just repainted it. Um, the coin door 
the paint's flaking off, so I need to redo that. Um, additionally, when I got it, this was originally an MVS2, and the operator that um, was using it actually had converted it over to a, um, a four slot, which is common. They sell kits to do it. But when he did that, he actually took out all the... In each individual marquee is supposed to be lit separately, and he just replaced it with a, um, a fluorescent tube. So now it's, um, you know, it doesn't light up like it should. Like, if I were selecting games, it should go to this one, to this one, to this one. You notice they don't match the games I have in here right now. Um, um, so, yeah, so the I'm actually getting some of this right here. And as well as another, um, a member on KLV is actually working on an LED replacement for these. So um, that'll be nice once that's done. Um, and then uh, inside this, you notice that there's no memory card readers either. Um, again, this was originally a um, two-slot, and they actually cut away the wood here. The wood comes out like this, and the board used to actually butt right up to the holes back here um, for the memory cards, which are back in that way. Um, and so you, the, on the two-slot, there's no memory card, well, not, um, there's no external memory card holder. It's built right into the board. But on these, you need the uh, special um, cape, ribbon cables to go in, so I'm going to be getting those as well. So I'm going to be getting, a, I'll be getting um, the memory card holder plus a memory card. Um, that's really cool. I'm going to get one of those uh, Neo Save Masters. I'll show you in that video. Uh, what else does it need to be done this? Um, oh, the head, there's no headphone jacks. I may do that as well. So anyways, I've got a little guy here who's handing me something. Um, thanks for watching, everybody. I will have another video for you. And uh, yeah, that's it for today.